A rocket carrying an experimental Japanese spy satellite has exploded just after its launch. The company behind the project had hoped to be the first Japanese firm to put a satellite in space. We're joined by our Asia correspondent Stash Butler. Some dramatic images coming out of Western Japan, Stash. That's right, Kieran. We're looking at here um, the launch and the aftermath of the launch of the Kairos uh, rocket uh, owned by a Japanese firm called Space One. Now, they had hoped to be the first firm to privately launch this kind of a satellite, a satellite that the Japanese government had hoped would act as a backup in case any of its current intelligence satellites were knocked out in any kind of emergency. Now, that launch took place less than an hour ago, and just moments after it happened, the satellite exploded. Unclear what caused that uh, explosion right now, and there's been no indication of whether anyone was injured. The, we understand that these kinds of launches typically don't involve people near the launch pad where fire crews have been putting out um, you know, the remnants of the flames, but still no confirmation on that front. But certainly a setback for this Japanese firm and for Japan's overall efforts to boost its domestic space industry with a flight like this costing on the scale of millions, if not tens of millions of dollars.